a list of materials you will need. Some paint and a brush, a ball tool and knife, glaze and TLS, some white clay, and a pair of earring backings. Using the white clay, break it into two equal pieces. These will be the ghost's body. Make sure the pieces are proportionate to the earring backings. You don't want your earrings to be too big or too small. Next, form your white pieces into a teardrop-like shape. The pointed part of the teardrop will be the ghost's tail. Your ghost should look like this. You should now have two little upside down teardrops for your earrings. Don't worry if it's not perfect, most people wouldn't notice. Now we're going to make the ghost's little arms. Break off a tiny piece of white clay and form it into an oval. Yours should end up like this. Repeat it for the other earring. We will be using the TLS to secure the ghost to the earring backing. Make sure to surround the backing with it so it doesn't come off. And there you go! Use parchment paper or aluminum foil as well as a glass container to bake your earrings. I baked mine at 30 minutes for 275 degrees Fahrenheit. Once you've let your earrings cool down, use a pencil to stencil in where you will paint the eyes. Get out your black paint and using a ball tool or a toothpick, paint in the ghost's eyes. I recommend using the ball tool since it makes it much easier to make it more uniform. Now we are going to paint on the ghost's blush to make it look cute. Here I mixed 3 fourths white paint with 1 fourth red paint. You can use your own pink paint if you don't wish to mix your own. Then add a dot of pink paint to give the ghost some blush. Use a toothpick and black paint to paint the ghost's mouth. Repeat it on the other side. This is optional, but once the paint has dried, you could use a glaze to seal the earrings and make it look shiny. Don't forget to glaze the other earring. After glazing both earrings, let it sit for an hour or longer to make sure it's dry. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hope to see you soon. Bye! We're doing the whisper challenge. Woohoo! Whisper challenge. You have to do is one person is going to wear the headphones. And the other person is going to like tell you a quote or a question 
and you guys have to the other person has to either lip read them or somehow guess what they're saying because it's gonna be hard with music blasting in your ear